hey guys in this video we are going to learn how do you pass a default value to a parameter inside a function okay myself rakesh and i welcome you back to my channel automate with rakesh guys please do support me by hitting on the subscribe button and please do hit on the bell icon to stay up to date with the contents that i upload with that let's get started and understand what is this default parameter is all about okay for that let's let's create a simple function first so i'm going to create a function so how will you create you use the keyword def define and i'm going to give it a name called function one let's say and i'm going to create a parameter called a i've created a parameter a now if to use the parameter i will say print a okay i'm taking a very simple example so that first of all you understand what is this default para you know value what i'm what i'm talking about so when i say when i pass a value called 10 here right so what i'm expecting this function when i'm calling with its name and passing the value 10 it is going to print the value 10 that's all i'm expecting okay done what would happen if i don't pass a value i don't pass a value so what is happening it is throwing an error now what is this default parameter value here is the parameter right this is the parameter so let's say i'm giving a value called zero default value i'm giving zero right now here i'm not passing a value i'm not passing a value so instead of it was giving an error now it is printing zero because the default value has been passed now what would happen now tell me what would happen if i let's say i'm passing four zero here if i'm passing four zero is it going to print zero or is it is going to print 40 so if i run this it's going to print 40 if you see it has printed 40 that means if you are passing a value it's going to override that if you are not passing anything that means the default value what has been given that be utilized okay so once you have understood the concept can i apply it to multiple things here yes, you apply you comma b comma let's say i'm going to say uh, 40 comma c i'm going to say let's say 50 right and here i am passing 40 and then um, i am passing b equals to uh, let's say i'm going to make it 80 right comma c equals to i want to say let's say 70 if i do this see i'm writing in a different way so what is happening because i'm saying print a it has printed a if i say print b or let me say comma b comma c now tell me is it going to print uh, 0 40 50 or how it's going to work so it has printed 40 80 70 40 so if i don't pass any value then how it will be print how it will be printing the values it will print 0 40 50 getting it so once you learn how it is working it is quite easy for you to you know apply your own logics and do whatever you like to achieve okay so default parameter passing that is a short video um, and that's all about the default parameter value function um, how do you pass that in python so that's all about it so thank you guys for watching it we are going to once again meet with another con concept of python and I, i'm pretty sure with the short bytes you are learning a lot of things and you are making a note of all the different things that you are learning every day so thank you guys for watching please do subscribe to my channel please do hit on the bell icon please do support me um, you know that will help me thank you guys we are going to meet once again in our next video bye bye